Good evening. Welcome to Chiller Night Theater. I am your host, the one and only Jack Shadow. Tonight I present the 1974 Italian horror movie, The Devil's Possessed, starring Paul Nazzi. The film was released in Italy under the title El Marisco del Inferno, which actually translates to Hell's Marshal. But we'll just keep that between you and I. Now, the American release title, The Devil's Possessed, sounds a lot more sinister, I suppose. Are you ready for more frightening fun, my children of the night? Then turn the lights down low and pull that blanket up around you tight. Get ready for medieval terror in The Devil's Possessed. Baron fellow, played by Paul Nashi, seems like a pretty bad fellow. He dispatches his men to kidnap a young maiden, kills her father when he tries to stop them, then brings her back and sacrifices her to Satan. Kind of a bad thing. Okay, but before that, he seems to have had some type of fit or something before his alone time with the young lady. What was that all about? I mean, I don't recall any part of the plan involving any bouts of intimacy prior to the sacrifice. No, the plan was to get the maiden, sacrifice the maiden, drink the blood of the maiden, and then your crazy alchemist should be able to do some really cool things for you and give you some, some neat powers and stuff like that. I think he tried to add a little extra ingredient to the recipe, you know what I mean? Didn't really work out for him, though, did it? <laughs> No, <laughs> no, it didn't. What's with all the blood drinking thing? I mean, I I'm a monster, so it's not really that big of a deal to me. But I do wonder sometimes, who makes this stuff up? I mean, is there an evil committee out there somewhere? <laughs> it's a question worth asking. Okay, silver lining here. We do have a hero, Gaston. Now we see Gaston ward off numerous attackers on a few occasions, so we know he's courageous and a trained fighter. Oh. <laughs> I wouldn't put his swashbuckling skills at the same level as Earl Flynn or Douglas Fairbanks Jr., but obviously he knows his stuff. Now let's hope his skills and courage are enough to take on the Baron as we return to the Devil's Possessed. Exciting stuff here, folks. The stone has joined the resistance against the evil Baron. They ambush the Baron's men, defeat them, and send C.A. back to send a message to his diabolical boss. Gaston then enters a tournament incognito against the Baron, who has no idea of his opponent's true identity. Now, for those of you unfamiliar with jousting, by the way, this was actually a favorite form of entertainment in the Middle Ages. It was basically a fight between two knights on horses, wearing armor, and using a lance to knock the other off his horse and defeat him in combat. If you're sitting at home thinking about becoming the next great joust champion, take my advice. Don't! You'll poke your eye out! See? It happened to the Baron. But he didn't see that coming. Or I suppose he literally did up until it happened. Now keep your eye, or eyes, one, two, three, four, however many you have, locked onto that TV screen. Watch indeed as we return to the Devil's Possessed. I hope you enjoyed the movie tonight. Hey, pretty cool fight between the Baron and Gaston at the end, huh? That was a real slobber knocker. <laughs> hey, I want to take a moment here to, uh, to read you a response on our YouTube channel. Now, this is from a subscriber, Michael Redcrow. Now, it's on the public page, so I, 
have no reservations sharing it here on, on the show. Now it says, just a huge fan of this channel, telling all my friends about it. Jack's character is so well done, and the late night horror films hosts are some of my very fondest childhood memories. My dad would sneak me downstairs after mom had gone to bed to watch them with him. He is gone now, but I know he is still with me when I put these old films on. Thanks again, Jack. Thank you, Michael. I'm, I'm sure he is. That was a fantastic compliment. Thank you. And now, let us put on another old film next week. As I feature an obscure chiller movie called Frankenstein 80. I'll see you next week. Same Jack time. Same Jack channel. And I bid you adieu, my children, of the night.